All right, the metric system. Way better than the American system. We use everything's in multiples of tens. It's ingenious. Choose an appropriate metric unit. Explain your choice. The height of a classroom chalkboard. So height can be measured in length and all that stuff. It's in the meter stuff. So you got centimeters, which are about this big. Millimeters are very small. Uh, decimeters, you don't really use those. Meters are about, they're kind of similar to a yard. So they're about this big. So I would say that's probably a good way to measure a chalkboard because it might be like two meters. So I would say meters. Uh, and why? Because uh, it'd probably be about two meters. Chalkboard would be similar to two meters. It's a pretty good estimate. The mass of a backpack filled with books. So backpack weight is like grams, right? So a gram is like a paper clip or something small like that. So if you put on a backpack that's filled with books, that would be like billions of little paper clips. So I would say I would go bigger than that, like kilograms. Those are pretty heavy. So kilograms, because this would be pretty heavy. So when it's going to be huge, you're going to want to go with the bigger units. And then the capacity of a bird bath. So bird bath, well, liquids can be measured in liters, right? So think of like a two liter bottle of pot. That's probably going to fill a bird bath. I mean, birds, they bathe just out in the open in like a little bowl. So I'm going to go with liters because it would probably be about, I don't know, maybe four liters. 